Hello, all you bound and mounted eye toys. Not to be confused with e toys. And of course, I mean eye toys as in like eye candy, you know? Yeah. I'm weird. And welcome to another episode of Gargoyle Lane Gaming. Well, Earthbound Beginnings on Memory Lane Gaming. Um, I have an idea. Fuck off! There is absolutely nothing on this mountain that I want to fight. Of course, saying that means that I'm gonna get into a lot of battles, aren't I? Oh, that's gonna hurt. Okay, that didn't hurt. Too bad. But I do have to heal already. Because enemies are enemies and dicks are dicks. Enemies are dicks. Oh, Mook. Mook A, Mook B, Mook C. And I will actually fight these. Hmm. Plasma beam. There we go. Okay. And Oh, wait. I should have put a shield up with Anna. Cause they use a lot of psychic attacks. That could be bad. Okay, that that's okay. That's gonna hurt. Oh god, 70. And once again, if you don't remember, the reason why fire is doing more damage to Tanuki than it is to anybody else. Boom! Oh, he survived. Never mind. <laughs> is because uh, Tanuki doesn't have a fire lessening item equipped, but the other ones do. Um, I probably should have given him one. Because I think he's still got, like, water or something. What am I doing? But... Yeah, I, I didn't, so... Suck it. Let's see if we can actually kill something. I probably should have healed Ana, actually, because she can actually revive people, but Tanuki cannot. Man, they like confusing him. Although, she will survive this. He would not have. Okay, that should be one down. Okay, good. This is kind of why I don't want to fight anything up here. Because they're all insanely strong. Okay. We will heal An Anna. Guard Lloyd. And um, I don't remember what the difference is. Okay, that's the difference. The life up that I chose heals everybody. Oh, good. <laughs> I was worried that that would be Anna. It doesn't fully heal them, but it heals them nonetheless. Okay. This is. Tedious. Plasma beam! And... Okay. We got... We got this! I just killed him already. Ow. Well, good job, Lloyd. Um... Yeah. Go back to Plasma Beam, and heal Lloyd. This should, this should be it, I think. Okay, that, that fight took a lot longer than I thought it would. 
A boat? The boat motor appears to be broken. But Lloyd fired it right up. Oh, good. At least one of our uh, team members is good at motor boating. Look at me go! Oh, I don't... No! It didn't actually suck me in until I got into it, but I, I had to make it look like it actually whirlpooled me down. Ooh, an elevator. That's not very good elevator music. I should replace that with good elevator music. Never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down. You guys... That's a dead end. You guys probably just heard some amazing music! And by probably, I mean of course you did. I picked it. Um... There's a lot of empty rooms. <gasps> fish! Such a huge fish tank with two fish. Although, I don't think it's actually a fish tank. I think it's a window because we're under the, the, the water. We're in the lake. We're under the sea! Okay, I'll stop. <gasps> There's more fish. <gasps> One fish, two fish, blue fish, red fish, ladder fish. Hello. What's over here? Nothing. What's over here? Nothing. There are cracks in those windows. That's probably not good. Um, talk to you. I am, of course, talking to myself. Feeling Tanuki's presence, the robot came back to life. My name is Eve. I have been waiting for you. My creator was George. He was taken to the end of the universe, then brought back later. That's an exciting story. I am here to protect you. That is my purpose. Oh, well, that's good. Oh, shit. I hope you can swim! Oh. I'm... I'm playing peekaboo. Haha! I was hiding behind Eve the whole time. So... This is actually an excellent example. Remember how long it took me to fight these guys? Now do you, um, see how long it's going to take? <laughs> Ow. 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 You're mean. So they can do damage to Eve, but I don't think they can destroy Eve. Oops. I could actually be trying to fight these things as well. But since I don't know which one Eve's actually going to attack, it's just probably better if I just guard and let Eve do all of the work. See, 826 damage. I think she slightly got me beat in the damage department. So, I'm probably... 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 Going to be... Um, fast forwarding through most of this because this is a very long tr uh, trip to where I'm going and it's just full of battles constantly so I will see you guys later
a cave? Um. Whoa, it's like Back to the Future. She's disappearing, and so is the present. A sea pendant. What does that do? Sea pendant. When you use it, it will defend against all Psy attack. Ooh. I think what that really means is that it will give you a defense boost against them, similar to the the other pendants. Like, uh, for instance, she had the H2O pendant on, which meant that she got uh, she got a bonus against fire. Fire damage did less damage to her. Now I think all types of psi damage do less. Doesn't completely negate them though. I will actually be doing a lot of level grinding while I have Eve. So I'm, I'm done fast forwarding because I'm nearly to the end of my, my trip which was shorter than I thought it was. So I will see you guys later. After this battle. <laughs> Because I would love you guys to see Last Starman. And uh, I'm actually going to be doing something a little odd. In case you didn't notice, that is not what I wanted. In case you didn't notice, I told Tanuki and Anna to guard, but I told Lloyd to attack. The reasoning behind that is actually because I want Lloyd to die. That's not going to make sense to you. Oh. Yet. It will make sense to you later. I'm actually going to give her the full blunt of this experience. So that she can catch up in levels a little bit better. Maybe. <laughs> Thank you, Eve. Nice. Very nice experience. But you will find out later why I wanted Lloyd to die. I didn't want Tanuki to die, though. So, once again, I will be cutting out... Uh, the grinding I won't be fast-forwarding so I will see you guys when I'm done with that Hello and welcome back so It may have only seemed like seconds to you it was hours for me Yeah, I I leveled up a lot. Anyway. We have now encountered R7038XX. You may remember this is basically the same uh, robot, although stronger. New and unfortunately improved. I didn't read that before, sorry. Uh, stronger than the one that I fought while I had a tank. This is actually supposed to be the third time you see him in the game, or at least see a robot of this type. I might as well just auto. Because this is like the tank battle in that I can't lose. So, I've literally put the controller down and I'm just talking now. Um, because Eve is doing all the work. And look at that. Eve was doing like a thousand damage to everything. Now Eve is doing like 13. These things are kind of strong. Just a tiny bit. <gasps> Eve exploded! You bastard! Aw, Eve. 
Eve, I love you. I'm talking to Eve. Robot Eve was demolished and moved no more. Examining the wreckage caused music to start. Tanuki remembered the tune. All right. Yeah, I... Oh, I spent... What am I doing? I need to actually fight these or run away. Because I don't have Eve here for me anymore. Um, flamethrower, there we go. And look at all these new gorgeous spells that she has learned. Look at these. Holy hell. I didn't even realize she had learned all these. Oh, she's missing thunder though. I don't even think I have enough PP to be using like the strongest stuff right now, so. And you may notice that Lloyd is still at level 28. Which I'm pretty sure is what he was at before when I killed him and decided I was going to start leveling up. And I'm totally gonna sneeze. Maybe. Oh god. This is horrible. Okay. I think I'm okay actually. That, that, that was unexpected and uh, not cool. Oh, I don't have anything. So let's do that. I, I'm honestly not even paying attention to what I'm doing and I probably should be. If they don't kill him. Ow. If they don't kill Tanuki, I might be able to do something on my next turn. Alright, whatever, that works. And let's just auto the rest of this. Because I think... I think we're probably just about good. And yes, I did revive Lloyd, even though I didn't really need to. Uh, mostly because I might as well, I guess. No sense in having him dead anymore. Uh, what I wanted to do with him has been achieved. Or kind of achieved. While it's true that having him dead gave the other two a lot more experience, a third more experience even, if you uh, understand mathematics, um, I, what am I doing? Oh yeah, I was supposed to heal. <laughs> That's what I was doing. There we go. Um, I, I guess I haven't actually technically achieved my goal, but, uh, it, uh I can't really talk about it. Oh God without uh, explaining it, or without um, giving it away, rather. Stupid battles! Okay, we're almost there. I, I need to do some healing now. Because these things are beating the hell out of me, and without Eve around to protect me, this is really starting to hurt. Oh, by the way, Tanuki now knows super healing as well. Why they give it to him so late in the game, I have no idea. Because this is literally the end of the game. I could end the game in this episode. I won't. Tanuki, welcome. I always believed that you would find your way here. Your great-grandmother Maria's love was scattered. Scattered in the form of melodies. I have a melody for you. 
Listen and remember. Tanuki remembered the tune. The crystal fragments that had broken off stopped glowing and disappeared. No problem, there's totally a problem. There's a rock in my way. And it's not Dwayne Johnson. So, let's go back to Magic Kid. I will heal. And then I will go talk to Queen Mary. In case you didn't gather that that rock that gave me the last tune. Yes, that is the final tune. Uh, Eve was the seventh tune, and that, that rock was the eighth one. Uh, the double X stone, rather, I guess. Not the rock. But anyway. That's not what I wanted. That was George's tombstone. on. I have to enjoy the music. And completely miss the door. This one? Aha! Red carpet treatment! Hell yeah! Please sing to me the melodies that you have learned. Ready. Yes, that's right. That is the song. Now she's singing. him as if he was my own child. He was always wagging his tail, just like a pup. Except for when I tried to sing him lullabies. Ah, George, this is your wife, Maria. I'm coming to join you. My purpose is complete. Where'd she go? Hey, don't disappear. After telling the story to Tanuki, with a rush of wind, Queen Mary vanished. As she disappeared, so did Magicant. Magicant was a mirage. A mirage born of Maria's consciousness. And I don't, I don't know why it like suddenly starts playing the magicant music because it kind of feels out of place in that moment. But this right here in front of me is George's tombstone. And <clears throat> right in front of me is the final cave, which we will be doing next episode. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I know, it's horrible. But we will be doing it next episode. But first... We must sing... To... The... Gigaborg. Gigaborg? I guess. <laughs> and, uh, yes, I'm doing this on purpose. Ooh, look at all those stats. I, I probably shouldn't have used all three characters to check. 
I am trying to die. It's just... Of course I would run into something that... Are you serious? <sighs> Alright, I'm just gonna auto this. And uh, if he dies, he dies. If I die, I die. Let the best man win! Which apparently is Lloyd. Holy shit, dude. He's like, You don't wanna use me? You don't wanna use me? I'll show you what you're missing. Ah, here we go. This'll totally kill me. <laughs> yeah, there we go. One down. The main reason why I want to die is it is incredibly hard to teleport off this mountain. Oops. But the onyx hook no longer works because magicant no longer exists and I want to leave the mountain. I don't want to go into the last cave just yet. There's one more thing I want to do before I do it. Okay, stop raising your defense. Nobody's attacking you. I Actually, I will attack you now because now I can't do any damage to you anyway. Okay, unless I do a smash hit. But I was targeting the super energy robot anyway, so. There we go. Anyway, as I was saying, dying will actually get me off the mountain faster than trying to walk back or trying to find somewhere I can teleport. Tanuki, Tanuki, you seem to be worn out from the fighting one more time. With his strength regained, Tanuki returned once more to the fighting scene! Do your best, Tanuki! Okay. Uh, this is actually the end of the episode. Next episode, there is one more thing I would like to do, and then we will finish this. So, thank you for joining me, and I will see you guys next time for the finale of Earthbound Beginnings.